The origins of the term bullpen are somewhat hazy, but something that is considerably more clear is the importance of the bullpen catcher. It's a funny position, really. You're not quite a coach, not really a player. You're, well, you're somewhere in between, but just where exactly is that? Well, that is the question that we're going to answer today. Justin Hatcher here is one of two uh, Padres bullpen catchers. I'm hoping this is my gear, which it turned out to be. And Hatch, as they call him, was kind enough to educate me on the finer points of how to protect oneself in the bullpen. Though I quickly found out it's one of those do as I say, not as I do kind of things. You don't catch with a chest protector? No, I don't ever use a chest protector. And the funny thing is, can, can I, I use a chest protector? Yes, you can okay. use one. Yeah. I just want to make sure that we've got that clear because I'm yeah. not too proud to put on all the equipment. I was kind of hoping for one of those. Uh, those dog suits, you know, where the dog attacks and the guys are right. I thought we might have one of those. Yeah, no, I this will have to do. I think it'll be beneficial for you to wear the chest protector. <laughs> okay. I have the same problem with my wife's bra. Don't worry about it. <laughs> Can't get the padlock off. What's the combination? That feels good. I'm gonna be honest. Look at that. That's not that thick. I mean, this isn't gonna stop a bullet. That I know. No. But if Hatch doesn't even wear one, then what am I worried about? Good question. I'm worried about looking good. Hat forward? I go. I mean, I've, I mean, obviously, this is how catchers wear the hat. Yeah. But you see guys sometimes do this and put the mask over the top of it. I don't even wear that thing. I wear this, my regular hat. Wait, 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 wait. You don't wear a chest protector and you don't wear a helmet? Well, again, I will be sure to wear all of the protective gear. And believe me, I did. Mask, helmet, chest protector, even a few unmentionables. But I'm told actually catching the ball is the best protection. I think now I just have to learn a little technique. Justin, thank you for that. We're going to go meet Mark Merrill. Mark was the Padres' main bullpen catcher for more than a decade, and he was the guy warming up Trevor Hoffman for a vast majority of Hoffy's nearly 600 saves. So, yeah, he knows a thing or two about catching the ball. With Hoffy, it was a lot of fun to catch with him because he knew exactly where the ball was going, and it was easier for me to catch. What's the number one thing I need to do here when I'm catching these guys? For you and us, these type of things, it's a lot more relaxed. I've never caught guys that are going to be throwing this fast, so I've I'm not what I would call relaxed. All right, would you do me one favor? You got it. When I'm in there catching, if I screw something up, either look the other way or coach me how to do it better. No, we're going to help you. Okay? Deal? Definitely. we got to get it done. But enough talk already. Time to shake off the rust with a couple easy ones from Hatch before the big guns step in. 83. 82? I mean, I got an eye. Do you want to know if 82 miles an hour is different from 90 miles an hour? I, I don't know yet, but here's the quick answer. Yeah, it's a lot quicker. And you see this sweat? That, yeah, we don't have a production assistant spraying that on me. That's real. That's, uh, that's actually real sweat. No blood or tears yet, but uh, I haven't caught Adams yet. As in Mike Adams, the eighth inning specialist with the nasty slider, See ya, grab some pine. Turns out he's got a pretty good fastball, too. Can you guys hear how that popped? Now might be a good time to go over the, uh, the hand signals. Fastball, curveball, slider, change. We gotta strike this guy out. What are we throwing here? All right, fastball outside. I remember there was only one job description for bullpen catcher. That was to catch the ball. He's bringing some heat. Caught that one. Ah. Oh, that's nice. He gets up there. Hold on, and this time three. Thank you very much. There's your, uh, there's your save. <laughs> and be honest, when it wasn't terrible. No, it wasn't terrible. <laughs> wasn't good, I guess, but I wasn't terrible. For, for, for being so long, not bad at all. Okay. Not bad at all. I caught a couple. Yeah. Okay. Hey, you, the ones you, you did miss, you kept them in front of you. That's all that matters. <laughs> all right, thanks so much. No problem. Appreciate thanks. it. Whew, that's a little anything you can do. I, uh, I don't recommend this for you guys at home, but I tell you what, I learned a little something today. What it was exactly, I don't know. You're going to have to read the blog. Thanks for watching. <laughs>